Let's learn what is IID. Let X be the result of a coin toss, and let Y be the result of a second independent coin toss. Random variables are independent if they provide no information about each other. There is no reason to believe that X affects the result of Y and vice versa. Both X and Y, they have the same distribution, Bernoulli, if the probability of success half. Therefore, they are independent and identically distributed. Let's again assume that X be the result of a coin toss and let Y be the Google stock price in the next day. Note that X and Y provide no information about each other. It's hard to believe that you can predict the stock price of Google based on a coin toss. The probability density function of the Google stock price is not the same of coin toss. Therefore, X and Y are independent and not identically distributed. Now, let X be the number of tails in any independent coin tosses, and let Y be the number of heads in those same tosses. In this case, X and Y are clearly dependent. If you know X, you know Y, and vice versa. Note that X and Y, they have the same distribution, binomial with any trials and the probability of success half. Therefore, they are dependent and identically distributed. Now, let X be the indicator of if Biden will win the election, and let Y be the average approval rating of Trump seven days before the election. X is a discrete random variable. One is Biden win the election and zero otherwise. Approval rating is a continuous variable that varies from 0% to 100%. And the information about Y, it is helpful to predict X. And the X and Y, they don't have the same probability mass function. One variable is discrete, another is a continuous variable. Therefore, they are dependent and not identically distributed.